Hello guys, Grey Gaiden here, and we are back to some Resident Evil. Let's see what we got in our inventory. We got the death, the death mask with no eyes, so we gotta go ahead and put that in the uh, slot inside of the catacomb. No, not the catacomb, the uh, graveyard puzzle place. Yeah, gr graveyard puzzle place. Oof. Yeah. Inventory. We got the armor key, so we got to do a little bit more exploring. And we still got the sword key. Got to use that somewhere. I got to drop off these ink ribbons somewhere else. Still got plenty of uh, handgun ammunition. And, uh, excuse me. Oh, that was a bad burp. Um, five rounds of uh, shotgun ammo. So I'm going to switch to the um, handgun, you know, since it has more ammo. And I'm going to save what I have left of that uh, shotgun. You know, the ammunition of that, you know, it's kind of getting spare, uh, sparse now. Did I already get this? I don't remember if I already, yeah, I already got that ammo. Time to go down the, uh, creepy stairwell. It's just so eerie how they have the uh, lighting down here. It's crazy. Okay, that's one. Yeesh. Here. You know, I wonder how they built this place. I mean, to. I mean, I know, you know, who built it. I've beaten the game, you know, I read the document, but I just want to know how long it took them to build this mansion and all the crazy shit inside of it. It must have took for, like, friggin' years. And, and hell, how do you silence all the builders? I mean, it must be like, it must be like some kind of tomb, you know, where they're all buried inside of the walls. Ooh, that'd be, that'd be a crazy, creepy pasta story right there. You know, all the workers who worked on the Arclay Mansion have been buried inside of the walls. Oh, man, that'd be freaking creepy, dude. Ugh. Okay, I need the helmet key to get through there. Okay. Okay, what else do I got here? Don't know why I did that, just did it to do it. Okay, armor key. Ooh, that's always good. Do I have a defense? Yeah, I have a defense on. Okay, that's good. Uh, yes, I'll take the grenade launcher. Now, you see, I didn't even see him in the introductory cutscene. I don't know how he got here. I guess he must be part of a uh, Bravo team. So, if that's the case in Resident Evil Zero, he must have really split off from the group, you know, after their helicopter crashed. Uh-oh. I need that. Oh, shit. 
Uh, he must have. I guess he was a little bit of a mix between a crimson head and a regular T virus infected uh, individual, I guess. As a matter of fact, it, it just looks like he has scratches all over him. It doesn't really look like bite marks. Maybe he got whipped by the, uh, um, one of those plant, you know, mutated plants. Yeah, that's, that's probably what it is, you know, because it might have thorns on it. He might have got, uh, infected with, you know, some thorns or something. It's something crazy like that. I just wish there was more answer, answers to what happened to Bravo Team instead of, you know, just Rebecca Chambers, who was part of Bravo Team. You know, I want more answers. Well, uh, I guess I could, uh, you know, order the Resident Evil archives. That'd be a good place to start. Okay, I have a key here. Whoa! Richard! Oh, I forgot that happened. It kind of freaked me out a little bit. You're wounded! <laughs> this whole place is a killing zone. Uh, there are monsters. Can't you get what did zombie, this to dude? you? A big snake. And it had to be poisonous. Poisonous? Richard, hold on. Bring me serum. I saw some, but didn't bring any. I'll go and get it, okay? You're gonna make it. Thanks. <laughs> I think I know what uh, I'm going to title this video now. <laughs> oh, don't mind me, guys. Okay, got to go down that way. We're off to save Richard, the wonderful uh, Richard of Raccoon City. Yeah, I shouldn't quit my day job. <laughs> go on a professional singing tour. <laughs> Now I'm going to have that stuck in my head. Oh, what the fuck? Ah, crimson heads. of my existence. Before he dies on me. It takes more time to actually get from place to place because of door animations. <laughs> God, if, if it was just like, you know, in the vein of Resident Evil 5 and 6, or, excuse me, 4, you know, with opening doors, it'd be less than two minutes before I could actually get there. Okay, let Here, me help you out, Richard. I'm going to give you a shot. Hang in there. Jill, here's my radio. Take it. I'm... <laughs> Don't die on me, Richard, now. Does it ever not hurt? <laughs> what kind of question is that? Uh, 
I'm okay. The others... Richard is resting peacefully. You should probably just leave him alone. Yeah, that's probably a good idea. Let me look around here and see what I can get. I'll take that. if I do. Oh crap, I realize I don't have something. I need a lighter. Dang it. Go ahead and let's see. Need the shield key. Damn it, I forgot where you get the shield key. supposed to go now. Dang it. <gasps> oh! I remember now that friggin' puzzle right there in the middle of the... Doi! Yeah, right here. I forgot all about this. That was the quickest I've ever done that of that puzzle. Okay, woe to those who disturb my sleep. There's a switch here, press it. Gimme, gimme. Okay. okay, guys, I think I'm gonna end it here. Uh, thank you for watching my video. Like, favorite, and subscribe, and I will see you next time. Alright, bye bye.